Just recently I've decided that I'd like to do something completely different, which has brought me to the SPA program. I was pretty much at a point where trying to find work. Looking after my kids. Hey, look after the children. Pottering around the house trying to apply for jobs. Yeah. I'm looking something to do part-time with computers. So I've been out of the workforce for about six years and I saw the Spark program and I said sign me up. This program that we're delivering is our first as a part of our Spark expansion. We were very fortunate uh, at Spark for Skills Canberra um, to approach us. We received some funding which means we could grow our program and this year we'll be delivering up to five new programs in the south of Canberra which is a first for Spark and a first for Gin and Dairy. The program we are delivering is called Spark Business Administration Program and students get certificate two in business administration from CIT at the end of this program. I have learned absolutely everything about computers. I'd never really even sent an email to anybody or done any computer work so it's really opened up like so many doors to me. Now we are doing some simulated business. These things are a little bit new for me. I've learnt Microsoft Word, Microsoft Excel which is spreadsheets and formulas. I never thought I could do formulas. Well up until last week I'd never actually used Excel and now I'm learning Microsoft Outlook. Every year when I have to deliver this SPAC program, I always get excited because this is something that gives me satisfaction that actually I'm making a difference to someone's life which needs most. Sort of at the beginning, I was feeling a little bit behind in that, but Alan kept pulling me inside and saying, you know, good work, Ashley, you can do it, great, you know, and that just sort of helped me get through those few doubts that I had especially too if you've been out of the workforce for whatever reason, that sometimes you need a bit of nurturing and you certainly get it with the Spark program. Raji was next to me and I was um, showing her how to do the programs and whatnot and having some nice chats with her about how different I guess India is and how they learn so differently to the system here in Australia. It was really interesting insight to a different culture and different person, yeah. I made new friends that are not my cultural background and it's nice. I gain more confidence from this program. Everyone are friendly, helping with uh, some other things, how to find a job or how to get into a volunteer work. It definitely has been one of the best things I have done. I am continuing on next semester with my Cert 3. Probably staying and doing a Cert 3 in Business Admin. I'm going to do Business Cert 3 next. I'm looking for a job, um, private sector. I want to go to work <laughs> and then side by side study is also good. First I want to get into the work. I want to apply for jobs and now I'm doing some, applying for some volunteer work. I want to get myself a job where I can sit down sometimes. <laughs> There will be a certain point of time where you want to give up and you said that that's it, I'm not going to do it. My advice to you at that point is look, up, look at you and look at your family and visualize yourself when you become successful. You are actually making difference to not only yourself but also to your friends, to your families. So never give up. Um, I just want to say I'm so proud of you. Um, Going on this program for some of you was a really big risk and a really big challenge. So thank you for taking a chance on us. Thank you for your commitment, your motivation, for your resilience. And Mel and I can't wait to work with you over the coming 12 months uh, and to support you on your journey of further study or employment. So best of luck and uh, make sure you keep in contact with us.